やれやれ取りつかにまさかここまで追い詰められるとはなクソも友達相手じゃなかなか全力は出せなかったみたいだね来たかここからは僕が入ってたいや久しぶりだねクソ誰だえー、分かんないってもう仕方ないなほらこれで奇跡が危ない危ないまだいくらでも手はあるぞお前の精神を問わなければな Weak looking main character that are actually overpowered is quite the popular trope, and many people seem to really enjoy watching a character get humiliated and then strike back with something completely unexpected, making them badass all along. So, in today's video, we will continue from where we last left off from the previous list a couple weeks ago with more anime recommendations regarding this topic right here. So, if you are new around here, then please do me a favor and subscribe with the notifications bell as it really helps my channel out in the long run. Now, without keeping you all waiting, let us begin with the video. We kick things off with Combatants Will Be Dispatched, in which this hilarious comedy series created by the same author of Konosuba follows an organization that seeks world domination, and the leaders have decided to roll a dice to decide who and which person will be dispatched for the job, and so they landed on, unfortunately, Agent 6, which was, for them, the absolute worst choice. Much like Konosuba, this specific group in the series acts quite similar, with unique attributes, personalities, and weaknesses. You just can't get enough of their wacky choices and decisions that may lead to their doom or even their success. A character that doesn't even realize his own insane strength is quite surprising, which is exactly what the show has for a main character. Lloyd has like superhuman strength and can one shot almost any mob or monster along his way, but he is unfortunately very oblivious on this fact as he views himself as the weakest person in the village. His dream is to become a soldier and so he enrolls into a military academy in a village. Crisis might even strike the village and maybe Lloyd can somehow help end the tragedy accidents and save the citizens from their deaths. Banished from the Heroes Party is quite a simple isekai series of a character who is thought to be worthless to the hero team. He's just a mere D-rank adventurer after, you know, getting kicked out of the party, he has decided to want to live a more peaceful life in a village and open up his very own pharmacy to help people through potions and medical aid. People underestimate his hero skills, he may be a D-rank adventurer after all, but he has more than what meets the eye. <laughs> This anime series revolves around a strange illness that are difficult to cure for normal doctors, and so they normally prescribe or recommend another doctor to look into this curse, and the person they go for help is for Dr. Ramune. Now, this man may not be powerful at all, but his extreme knowledge on these diseases is what helps save these poor people from their suffer. He offers them items that help reduce the disease effects and, of course, ways to get rid of it as well. It's quite iconic to watch, and truly a very fun series indeed. だろ。<笑><笑> I think you all might have heard of Talentless Nana, which is an anime series similar to a game called Among Us. A girl named Nana who secretly works for an organization where she was tasked to eliminate those who possess great power that are seen as a threat. She has no powers at all, but she pretends to have one where she can read people's minds. She is the smartest character in the series, tricking everyone to believe in her stories until the time is right to where she can kill the other students. She blends in well and hides her true identity, but will she be able to complete the mission and remain hidden? Now that that is pretty exciting to watch.
Inspector is a heavy detective mystery series that centers around a girl who was murdered. The main character is a powerful being who is immortal and cannot die through his mistakes and works alongside his partner to solve the case and hunt down the entity or ghost named Steel Lady Nanase. This anime is actually getting a second season down the line, maybe in 2022, which I'm actually quite excited about. This anime has a lot of great things to offer and I can guarantee enjoyment from watching. Sports anime is definitely one of my favorite anime genres, and in this specific one, we talk about basketball. Sora is a short young boy who enrolled into a new high school to follow his dreams of joining the basketball team and reach the nationals. His mother is a former professional player who used to play but had fallen under an illness that made her retire. Unfortunately, the chosen school for Sora has delinquents that took over the basketball club and they really don't even take anything seriously. Many underestimate Sora for being short, as in basketball, only the tall ones usually get selected and are much stronger, but for his case, he will show everyone that size doesn't matter at all. Mop Psycho 100 is an iconic series that showcases one of the best of a weak looking high school boy but holds tremendous psychic powers. Mob works alongside Raigen in which they both help people in exercising evil spirits on the loose. No one in school really knows about his powers at all and his powers specifically reach 100% which is his full power but he can even go beyond his full power to an unknown level which no one really knows but it is said that he could even destroy destroy the whole world if he chooses to. <laughs> This right here is quite a new gen shonen series by the name of Radiant, which follows a sorcerer named Seth who aims and wishes to become the best sorcerer there ever was. However, his magic capabilities are very low to where his dreams will never be achieved unless he works really hard. People in this world actually hate sorcerers in general, and Seth wants to change the people's perspective and viewpoint by somehow helping them from dangerous monsters. So now he ventures off to find a mentor that said they would teach him more about magic powers, and thus the great adventure now begins. Finally on this list we have is Psyche Kuso, a child born with psychic abilities at a very young age. A very mysterious person he really is which sparks so much interest to the people. At his teenage years he now attends high school, you know, wishing a more peaceful life and staying away from people in general, but, you know, so that nobody will find out about his powers. However, that life that he wants unfortunately turns upside down when so much attention was brought upon himself because he is just so interesting to hang out with. With. Now he will learn what having friends is like and possibly get hooked into a relationship with someone, quite possibly, but we shall see. Looks like we have reached the end of the video as that is all I have for now, but I just wanted to thank you all for watching all the way to the very end up to this point, and if you did enjoy the video then please smash like to show your support, and as always, I'll be seeing you all in the next one.